66, I'll have an ace up my sleeve. <laughs> Always got it, courage. Deep down inside our hearts. We're always keeping our eyes on the darkness of the world. When everything looks hopeless, dreams are cast to the wind. When the people only see darkness, that's when we arrive on the scene. We can got us all victory smiling. Arise, force us all darkness on your retreat. Shout and now feel the fighting spirit. Never forget, she fight us. here again yeah last night hook stumbled in with his eye all beat up it looks like I was taking care of him until I fell asleep I have to work late tonight will you be all right here on your own what time are you gonna be back don't just skip dinner like you did last time I left something for you in the fridge all you have to do is heat it up I'll get by I guess or I could just have Giselle from next door come by and... Mom, did you forget how old I am? Don't worry about me. Okay, but make sure you sleep in your room tonight, honey. You got it. Don't worry about me, Mom. Hurry up and get ready for school. <laughs> Whoa, Lynn, you're even later than me. What? Just today I was. Not usually. Good. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> Lynn! you promised me you wouldn't be tardy ever again. I couldn't help it today. With my mom out of town, I had to single-handedly do the cleaning, laundry, and dishwashing. And to top off that, I had to feed the cats. I have ten of them, you know. It's not that I don't believe you, but you leave me no choice but to ring up your house. Oh, hi. <sighs> yes. I was just wondering if you'd be available for a parent-teacher conference this evening. <sighs> oh, no, it's no big deal. Ugh, nobody believes me anymore. All right, all right. But if you do this one more time, it's a parent-teacher conference for sure. Yeah, I got it. Now, run along home, Lynn. Yes, Mrs. Aaron. <sighs> Woohoo! I'm safe! Oh? Uh, 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 Ralph? What's wrong? Uh, Are you sick? <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> if you wanted a parent-teacher conference, 
You should have followed through with it. Hmm. I'm home! If you're curious about my schedule, I'll go ahead and tell you. Starting now and continuing on until dinner, it's game time. Then after dinner, until 9 p.m., I've scheduled some game time. And then from 9 until Mom gets home at around midnight, it's game time! <laughs> Gosh, guys, I'll be tied up for the whole evening. Huh? What's wrong with you guys? Ah, you're sulking like that because I'm too busy to hang out today, huh? I'm sorry, guys, but it's just one day. This is awesome! Let's go, Yo Get a Master! Huh? Who could that be? Miss Giselle, what brings you, you. Oh, don't worry about fixing me dinner. I can handle it myself. What's that? A uh, rag? Huh? It's actually a blouse that I only just bought yesterday. I'm going to report this to the animal shelter and have them round up those cats so fast it'll make your head spin. <gasps> now, wait just a second. I don't think my cats could do that kind of damage. Well, who did it then? Um, the lawnmower? They won't cause any more trouble, I promise. I'll crack down. Just give me one more chance. Please, Miss Giselle. Fine, but this is your last chance. And mend my blouse. <laughs> Me? Mend? Until your mom gets back, there'll be no games for you, young man. It's high time you learned how to sew anyhow. <sighs> Are they getting back at me for not hanging out with them today? There'll be no more games for you, young man. <gasps> Don't worry, I'm not playing around. <laughs> Oh, Mrs. Aaron, I, I thought we decided not to have the parent-teacher conference this time. Well, yes, but you don't mind if I come inside for a moment? Oh, sure, yeah, come right in. Today is the worst day ever. Huh? You guys already know Mrs. Aaron? Wow, Lynn. You sure have a lot of cats. Yes, you'll recall that I did mention that before. Ah, uh, I'll just show myself around. You go ahead and keep playing your video games. <gasps> games? Sure, why not? Ah, oh, yeah! Then enjoy your self-guided tour. It looks like he's not keeping you in his house after all. <laughs> That's right! I can ask Mrs. Aaron to mend this for me. Have you concluded your self-guided tour, Mrs. Aaron? Strange. She just walked down. Huh? <laughs> Mrs. Aaron, where were you? <laughs> I have a little bitty favor to ask. If you know how to sew, would you mind? Lim, <gasps> where are you keeping it? What? C66. Who? The one you call Bolt Cat. <gasps> How do you know about him? You fool! Do I look like Aaron to you? Then who are you? <laughs> Running away. <laughs> you haven't forgotten me, have you? Why are you doing this to me? Summon C66 at once. I don't 
don't even know what that is. Hmm. Really? No. I'm telling you, I don't know where he is. But you can call him. Hurry up. If you don't, you'll lose more than just Bolt Kit. I'll take every single one of these vampless cats, too. Leave my cats alone! <laughs> All you have to do is summon C-66. Do it. Now. Stop it! Now, who could that be? I have no idea. It doesn't matter who it is. If they take even one step inside this house, you know what happens, don't you? Yes. I'm just here to make sure you had your dinner. Do you have someone over? Uh, um, well... You've just been playing your games this whole time, huh? Y uh, well, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Lynn's homeroom teacher. Oh, poor dear. You must have your hands full. Oh, it's not really that... Of course it's hard, dear. Being put in charge of kids like Lynn, it must be more than a person can handle. <laughs> Lynn. Give me my clothes back. I'll just fix them myself. Uh, they're downstairs. <clears throat> I'll go and get them. <laughs> Guys, we gotta get out of here. <sighs> now tell me, dear, how is Lynn in school? L Lynn? Well, he's quite the model student. Oh, come now. If he were a model student, I don't think you'd be making a house call like this, now would you? <laughs> Back in my younger days, I too was an educator, so I know what it's like to have unruly students like Lynn. I'm sure he's quite the troublemaker at school. And his grades. Oh, his grades are a disaster. And tardy every day like that. <laughs> Even though Lynn can be a handful, he really is a good kid at heart. <laughs> well, just from the way he's taken in all those stray cats, it's easy to see. Sometimes he even runs errands for me, the little sweetheart. <laughs> he lost his father, <laughs> you know. But even still, he's never strayed from the park. Oh! Maybe you shouldn't scold the boy so much. Isn't that right, <laughs> Bold cat! <laughs> What's wrong with you guys? <laughs> Just as I thought, you were the perfect bait. What did you do to my friends? Pitiful. You still think those cats are your friends? Vulcan! No! <laughs> yes, my little spiders love to suck up energy. They are quite the opposite of your bolt cat. I put everything into designing the perfect weapon to catch him. Everything is turning out <laughs> just as I planned. <laughs>
Or should I call you Bonecat? If you want to save his life, you'd better do as I say. No, Bonecat! Don't listen to her! Now! You can't escape because you want to save him. Wow, it's so touching. Oh, cat? Fine. I'll let you have him then. Oh! Don't worry. These nets aren't harmful to humans. It's a different story for you, though, Bolt Cat. Come and get him! were a complete failure. Huh? Just who do you think you are impersonating me like this? That's what I should be asking you. What do you think you're doing? Oh, Mrs. Giselle. And who are you? And what's with the weird costume? Which one of you is the real Giselle? It's me, of course. How dare you besmirch my name? At your age, ladies. Lynn, hurry up and finish off this imposter. What? What are you doing? How did you know I was Lynn? If you don't want to get blasted, show me your dentures. I'm in big trouble. Oh. Mook, you there? I have an itty bitty favor to ask. Wow, being here early? It's like a whole new world. Oh, Lynn! What are you up to? Huh? Uh, I'm just, uh. Anyhow. What brings you to class so early this morning? I thought the day would never come. Oh, yeah. I just thought that if I kept being late every day, something bad might happen. Huh? 
Anyway, Mrs. Aaron, everything really did turn out for the best. Happened here? <laughs> 